Shopping for what are we shopping for? Probably go to Myers and see what they got. First time here. What else are we doing today? We're gonna go to Ashley's shop for a kitchen table. Go to Best Buy see what their TV's looking like. And see what they vlog and stuff looking like for YouTube. So yeah, today is a very eventful day. Eventful. Yeah, let me put my mask on. Oh yeah, got my mask on, y'all. We in this piece. We in this piece, you see, baby chunks. That's her nickname. Put her mask on. You got the lashes on the door, can I see how you coming? She trying to mask me with the J's, you know. She trying to mask me with the J's on her feet, but you know. But yeah, so guys, hopefully you guys like and enjoy this video. We gonna have fun. We gonna do a lot of things. We ain't doing that much, y'all. We just shopping. And hopefully getting some different food. Hopefully they got some different food that we never seen before. Chipotle? We still got Chipotle. No, I'm just playing. Whatever you point is, we gotta go to Best Buy. Yeah, I just had that earlier today. I mean, earlier yesterday, so. Cancel it. All right, see y'all in the stuff. That's Meyer, you guys. You got the fresh side over there. You got the home side over here, y'all. So we trying to figure out we gonna go to the home side first, see what they got. So there. we're in Myers for the first time, y'all. And he just got some deodorant. Oh, they got got to be blue. Let me find out. Got to be blue over here. Mm -mm -mm. I don't know what he's looking for now. Looking for some bed sheets. Cause he only got one set for his new bed. So we gotta get some new ones. So that we don't just have one set, so that we have more than one. Oh, they got Columbia bed sheets. That's exclusive. In the air freshener section. They got every every scent you could think of. What's your favorite scent? Mine? I had this cotton candy one before and it slapped. It was great. He loves the black ice flavor, which is that one. But it's just cool to me. It smells like strong cologne. And then you got the other ones. Those are pretty good with the gel in them. And then you got these little Yankee candle ones. I never got one of these before though. Save big on electronics. All right, y'all. So we just got out of Meyer. Um, Tyler was rushing me. I didn't have time to look at everything I wanted to look at. <laughs> but from what I did see, because I didn't even get to vlog this, the fresh section, but they had a lot of um, good groceries and stuff. It's basically like a, a upscale Walmart to me. Um, but I would rate that store um, 8.5 out of 10. What about you, Bay? Give me like a 7.8. Okay. It was a good store. I mean, I liked it. But, you know. Would you drive all the way out here again? I mean, it's lucky I drive. It's like 12 miles from my house. I mean, 15 from my house. So. I would. I would drive out here again. They got some good stuff to me. Um, Not every day, but, you know, every once in a while. I would make a trip. He's trying to put this stupid air freshener thing up. So I don't even know what that is. That's the new new. Apparently, you put it on the on the um the mirror. It's not working. Do you smell it? Yeah, I do smell it. It's not that strong. Yeah, I smell it. But um, yeah, y'all. So now we headed to our next destination, which is Best Buy. Best Buy, and we gotta hurry up in there because. We got popsicles. Well, I got popsicles and I got mochi. Oh, terrible. <laughs> and I got mochi, y'all. If y'all don't know what mochi is, it's basically like ice cream inside of this. It's, yeah, it's this little soft doughy type thing. I don't even know. Oh, it's rice. Um, 
rice dough or something. It's, it's something made out of rice. And that's on the outside. And then on the inside, they have um, ice cream. So I got the strawberry kind and I got the mango kind. Woo! So good. Don't they sell um, them in, um, don't they sell those in California? Is them where originally originated from? I have no idea. But I remember one summer I found out about them because I went to Whole Foods and they just had them like in this little freezer thing. They just had them sitting out basically for anybody to come and like scoop them. Yeah, scoop them and put them into their own little box. Mm -hmm. Like you could get as many as you wanted to. Yeah, I thought that was a bad idea back then. And now look, now it's a whole thing going on. So they definitely not doing that again. But yeah. This kind is actually in the box already, so I know it's That's sanitary kind of and safe. And they actually had that at my school too, like with the little freezer thing, but I never got it out of there. I think, actually maybe I might've got it once, but after that I was like, uh-uh. So I haven't had it since I've been to college, which is like almost a year now. Or, yeah, or whatever, a year plus. Ooh, Firehouse Subs. I want to try that one day. Never had it. I was a friend that worked there. Yeah, I saw this mukbang years ago with these with these twins. I tried it. But, um, yeah, y'all. Um, What else? They have a really good um liquor section in there. And your girl is turning 21 in less than two months. You feel me? You feel me? So, I'm going to be back for show for show. Okay, they had all the Capriccios you could think of, all the 1800s. I all didn't get marks. to see if they had the dark liquor because I only went on one side. <laughs> I only got to go on one side of the store. Oh, I mean, of the liquor section part. Because he was like, let's go, let's go, let's go. But any other day, he want to uh, look at the liquor section. It's cool though. I'll be back. But, um, yeah, it was just a nice store so now we on to the next place at Sibby's furniture store you guys and we're looking for a table for Tyler to get because he's trying to get all his furniture together so that when he's ready to move out of his this is exclusive yeah I know where I'm coming to shop Okay, y'all, I don't know where I left off in that last clip because the lady came up to us and interrupted my whole thought, but we was in Ashley Furniture Store because we're looking for a table for Tyler to get for his future apartment, but right now he's gathering like up most of his furniture in his parents' house right now, so yeah. I'm going to hit the road running. Right, so... Right now, he already has his bed. We already got TV. We just need another one for the living room if he wants that. Um, but today we're looking for just a table and uh, maybe some chairs. But the table that we found in there that we really liked um, costed $400. But today they had a special sale, 50% off. So. That would have made the table two hundred dollars, but <laughs> the full set, like the chair and the four chairs, I mean the chair, the table and the four chairs would have been a thousand something. I was like a thousand. Nah, just buy the table and buy the chairs at a different time, cause you could use any any chairs for real. For for right now, and then you know, just get the right chairs later. Crazy bins. What's crazy bins? Oh, uh, bins. Like a container store. It's crazy bins. Yeah, y'all. So now we're on our way to. Oops. I need a whole different list. But now we're on our way to Value City to see what they got. And he might buy the table today. He might not. But I think that that was a good deal. Because. It's only today, 50%. You don't really see 50% of places. Like, at least I don't think. I don't really shop at furniture stores a lot, but I don't think you come across 50% every day, so. Yep. Yeah. Look at this mirror. 
corner right here this is it like just imagine how many pictures don't mind my clinic don't just imagine how many pictures i could take in this mirror and look at this one over here too this is beautiful i wonder if it comes lighted like this or oh yeah it has the little button you just touch and this one you probably plug it up too so y'all i'm getting a little uh depressed right now because <laughs> I just keep seeing furniture that I like and that I'm so ready to move out soon. Like, I just love decorating stuff. Like, when I used to live in my, um, in my dorm. Yeah. Uh-huh. When I used to live in my dorm, I just enjoyed buying new things to decorate it and just making my own place. Buying little cute little things like my room my dorm room is nice compared to a lot of other people's they didn't even have a lot of stuff that I had like even though it was a small space I still decked it out but yeah this made me kind of sad because I'm ready to move out so but it's gonna take a minute though I either gotta get a job or I gotta make something shake but I'm gonna be moving out soon and look at these pictures behind me y'all like beautiful just be just hey girl like look at this y'all couldn't y'all see me with that could y'all see me with that painting in my house <laughs> i'm a fool <laughs> but these tables are beautiful do y'all see what i mean like that's so nice they got some really nice furniture here. Hold on, come look at the one. Come look at this table. Look at this. That is so cute. No, it's not lit up. It's just different colors. It's raw. Look at this little table, y'all. Like, that is so cute. Don't, don't let me get a couple dollars. I'll be in here. Too. It's so many nice furniture. It's so many nice furniture pieces in here. I wouldn't know what to choose. Just to fit a small little apartment. Okay, hey, y'all, a celebration is in order. We got the table. Yay! We came back and got the table that I was talking about. That was two hundred dollars. So it came all together to two eighty nine because you know tax and all the other fees, delivery fee, whatever, whatever. But yeah, y'all. When we got back in there, that lady was crazy. Like, she was trying to make us buy the whole set once again. Like, I already knew what type of time she was on. Like, and I, I feel so good about myself. I feel like somebody's mother because I'm like, no. I'm like, no, we're sticking to what we came here for. Even though I wasn't buying nothing. I'm like, we're buying what we said we was coming to buy. Because I hate when you go somewhere and they just keep trying to add little stuff in. Like, no, I'm cool. Can you turn this off real quick? I don't want the, want the sound to be messed up. But yeah, y'all, we went back in there. She was like, yeah, so uh, why are you buying this table? Like, are you moving soon? And we're like, yeah, we're just, like, asking us a whole bunch of questions that don't even need to be asked. Like, do are you going to sell us the table or not? That's how I was feeling. Like, and then she was like, um, she was like, we told her, like, we were trying to buy piece by piece. Like, we don't have a place yet. Like, it's just we're just trying to buy furniture and she like oh well you could finance the chairs with it and da 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 and i'm like i'm thinking in my head like girl you don't just chill from 700 to 949 with the chair exactly was like, she, Jordan was like, so she had us she had to sit down at this table and she had wrote everything out and i already was thinking in my head like whatever she says we're not we're not doing it like i'm just letting her do her little thing because i don't want to be rude so i'm sitting there and she's writing it all out and she's like well if you do this and you finance each month it's only going to be $76 a month. no she said a hundred something a month yeah she changed that was for six months man it was 150 months for six months and then 76 dollars a month for 12 months yeah but that's a long time though if, if you if you like lose your job and that's within that 12 months your credit goes down terribly like you go find it a perfect credit score to have a terrible credit score all because of $76 a month. 
Right, and I'm just like, no, nah, it's not even worth that. Like I said, we could come back, come back and buy the chairs, or we could find the chairs from a cheaper place because, like, even my parents got like nice furniture and stuff like that. Like, I'm sure we'll find chairs easily somewhere else, or even if we don't come back here. But yeah, she was trying to get him, and then he falling for it. He over here like, oh, she like, you can come over here and check your credit. She walked us to this other place. It was like a big screen, touch screen, where you check your credit. He up here typing in his information. I'm like, hold on. She walked away for a second. I'm like, hold on, babe. Like, Cancel are you my... sure you want to do this? Because I'm like, I'm telling him like everything, like, this is that and that's that. Like, we don't have to buy it. Like, she's just trying to get us to buy it because of her. She wants a higher commission. Like, because with a $200 table, I'm sure she got, like, $30 or something. Or she got, she probably got a low commission. Like, girl, I feel bad. I'm sorry. But we don't have no money to get. Like, this is, like, we just trying to buy the essentials. Like, we don't got time to be playing with you. We don't got money to be just blowing carelessly. Like, no. So, yeah. Um, then I told him, I was like, yeah, no. We're just buying the table. Like, don't even put in your credit. Because then they're going to look up your credit. And that's gonna drop your credit. Like that's a whole waste of time. Yeah, if I get a car, I'll drop my credit like a couple points. Bruh. So yeah, I'm I'm so happy. I hope you uh, erase your information. I do. But yeah, so then we walked back over just to, to the table, and I think she got salty because after that she she stopped looking at me. Like she started just looking at him, talking to him the whole time. Like before she was nice, and she was talking to both of us. She had access to our names and stuff. But after I had told him, like, yeah, no, just go tell her just the table, she just was only looking at him. And I'm like, yeah, I, I'm making sure that he came here to buy what he want. Because I hate when salespeople try to do that. And that's why you always have to carry somebody with you when you buy a new stuff, buying a new car, a new anything. Because you just looking to get, you as the buyer, you're just looking to get the stuff. Like, you're so excited, you got your money and stuff. But the other person is there to make sure you don't get jipped out your money because these people they see that you excited and they try to take advantage of you and mm -mm, I was not having it so I was so proud of myself y'all but you know that's my job okay that's my job as a girlfriend but um yeah y'all so now we on our way to five guys to go get some food um I was trying to look for something different to eat today but you know this is Ohio we don't really got that many choices if you want to get something different, you got to know somebody who cooks that at their house, basically. If you want some some African, some Jamaican, or some Mexican food or something, like, you got to go to somebody's house that you know. Or some Indian food. Like, I found this good Indian place, but, like, you know, the stuff ain't the same. Like, it's not the same compared to when you go to somebody's house and they really cooking it, like, putting their foot in it. It's not the same. At a um, at a commercialized like restaurant or whatever. So you know, down here all we got is the fast food options: Five Guys, McDonald's, Wendy's, Charlie's. You know the same food pretty much. So we're just gonna go get us a little quick burger. 